Start recording. Stop recording. Button. Speech off. A very cool box may be coming on December 22nd or 23rd. What I'm going to do is pretend that I don't know what's in it, which I do not know what's in it. And even if I did, I wouldn't tell you guys. I might do a video trying to uh, keep my patience up. So, um, so basically, uh, why don't you guys help me out with a Christmas special? Um, the Christmas special can be anything. I don't care what it is. It could be a Boppin' video, a TTS video, or it could be Boppin' and TTS. It can be, uh, any kind of video you guys want. So, please help me out, because last year I did a live stream. The year before I did a Boppin' uh, refresh video. Please help me out. Thank you. Your comments are welcome, except for the bad ones. So, chances are I could be getting a bop at extreme and something that is personal. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you because it's personal. So, anyways. <clears throat> there could be a chance I could be doing a redo of the bop at extreme from 1998. And this time, it'll probably be brand new. And I found out what the bop at extreme... Okay, if you're a bop at extreme fan... If you're a fan of just the Bop It Extreme, um, I'm not a particular fan of it because of the, the scoring system. But whoever unsubscribed, please tell me in the comments below why you did and how you want me to do my videos better. I know people are trying to be doing Bop It, but what else could I do? Like, I could do Ninja Turtle reviews, or, I don't know, my Bop It videos tend to get a bunch of views, so, I don't know. Electronic Game Hub, whatever their names are, uh, you tend to support me, whatever. So, whatever you guys decide for me to do for my Christmas special... You got to let me know in about 11 days. So in a little under a week. So, <clears throat> if the box. So I guess someone gave me a hint that there's a box coming. Okay. So, <laughs> I don't know what the heck is in it. I just don't know what the heck is in that thing. Okay, so I don't even know what the heck is in the box. What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> Excuse me. What's in the box will be no one's business until December 25th. Probably about three days later. <clears throat> so... Please, guys, help me out with the Christmas special. Special, 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 special. <clears throat> so, anything, I mean anything. So, there's probably going to be a Bop It Extreme in there. So, guys, just be prepared. There could be. I don't know. If there is a Bop It Extreme, I think what I'm going to do is um, probably try to see if I can open the box with something. I'm going to see if I can try to open the box. And get the extreme out and whatever else is in that box that is probably personal. The bop it, uh, the bop it I'm going to share with everyone. But I don't even know if it is a bop it extreme or not. So, there's probably going to be a bop it in there. There's probably not going to be. But who knows? I don't know even the first thing about 
the Bob Prediction Dream. Let's just pretend I never did that video, okay? But I did do a video on a huge Bob and Extreme, and <clears throat> back to the thing that I was going to talk about before I even got off topic. So, basically, the Bob and Extreme, the spin it mechanism, if you know, it like makes like a like a clicking sound whenever you spin it. And the Extreme too. Let me grab that. Yeah, Bob and Extreme 2 also makes that sound, but a little bit. But, once you get the spinning mechanism a bit worn out. Yeah, Bob and Twisted Board spinning flicker. Yeah. <clears throat> there is something with the mechanism that, like, okay, so they don't make Bob and what they used to. That's the phrase. But, you better be glad that they made the bop it like how it is. Because the bop it extremes spin it mechanism, it's like this. Okay, so if you hit the bop it extreme on the arm where the spin it is, then <clears throat> the mechanism will malfunction and it will lead to what it sounded like when I did the My Bop It Extreme is Broken video. Then, if you, if you still spin it and play with it, chances are it'll really get worn out until the part, I mean, until the, until the time of it being non-registerable or whatever, I just made up a word. <clears throat> Not being able to register that, I mean, to the point where it's going to be, uh, to where you can't, to where it won't re register anymore, then that'll be the baddest thing. I mean, that'll be the, the worst thing, okay? I'm making up words now. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> okay, so, look out, because here goes the bop next Okay, just kidding. I don't know. I don't know where the Bop and Extreme is going to be in that package. But if it is... <clears throat> wait for it. Boom! Now, I will not be able to open the, the Bop and Extreme's package because, because it requires a knife and whatnot. But what I will do is show you the Bop and Extreme within the package. It'll probably be like, go over here and try to get it. Ouch. It's definitely your dust. Let me see if I can try to even get to it anymore. Oh, wait a minute. I don't think it's even here. Hang on, let me try to get it over here. Try to get over here. Can't get to it. I can't get to it. Yeah. Okay, it'll probably be like the Bop and Extreme 2 packaging. A little bit. Ouch. Man, my back. Just. Well, anyways, I lost the, uh, the package for the Bop and Extreme 2. Yeah, really, just lost it. And the instructions are in there too. Wow. <clears throat> Cannot believe it, can you? <laughs> well, and it'll be surprising if I do get a Bop It Extreme 1998 brand new in the packaging. Like, really, it'll be uh, very cool. And once you get the Bop It Extreme out of the package, 
them staple on the spinning. <laughs> Why did Hasbro do that? Well, I'm not a boppet maker or anything. I'm not the boppet designer or anything. I'm not the boppet producer like Dan, Squ Dan Quitchner is. But <clears throat> my guess is that back in 1998, since the boppet, the spinning mechanism breaks real easily, I think the reason, I think the tape on the spin it is what keeps it fresh. And <clears throat> if you do not mess with the, the package, I mean, the, the, not the package, I'm talking about the, so literally, basically I was looking on eBay and found a link that I sent to someone and I hope that's the link that I get. So it said nine it's a nineties vintage electronic Bobbit Extreme original packaging or whatever. But it said something like that. And it was like a hundred and something I don't want to say the full price. But it was over a hundred bucks and you can't beat that. Um there was another one that said something about the the Boppet Extreme being in the original, the original Boppet Extreme, I didn't trust that, so I wanted to try to find something that was <clears throat> more accurate, and I just hope that it's the Extreme. Um, about 90% of the time, it will be, I mean, about 90% of my brain, I mean, of 90% says it'll be a Boppet Extreme, because... I mean, sure, eBay sellers are not accurate with their uh, their uh, products. You know, some people say, oh, it's the original Boppet, or oh, it's the, the original Simon. But then they just end up selling you this 2000 Boppet original, like Rally and Electronic Games did get. <clears throat> I heard on a channel named Rally and Electronic Games that this girl who was Riley, got a Boppet original that was, that was the 2000, the 2000 edition of Boppet. <clears throat> there are two different, three different versions of the original. There's the original 1996 that everyone in the 90s has grown accustomed to. Then there's the 2000 with the millennials, the millennial kids have gotten or those same kids that got the original 1996 got. Then there's the 2002 small edition. Now, <clears throat> I don't know how small the 2002 is, but I'm I'm kind of sure that it's not too much bigger than the Bop and Micro. I'd say it's probably like maybe seven, eight inches. It's small, okay, the Bop 2002. It's still the same concept as the original and the 2000 Bop it but just smaller and easier to play. So, <clears throat> I'm sorry if I'm talking about Boppet and probably talking about what I might be getting uh, as far as the old Boppets go. So, I might be getting in the way of Boppets, the Boppet Tetris and the Boppet Extreme. I might be getting those two. I highly anticipate the Boppet Extreme brand new, and the Boppet Tetris, brand new. <clears throat> if you don't know what Tetris is, it's a video game, or it's a game, where there's like a playing field, where you'd have to fill in the square, you have to fill in the spots with squares, and other shapes. <clears throat> I believe it's just squares. There's four different levels on Boppet Tetris. There's drop level, there's the blast level, there's the double drop level, and then there's the shuffle level. There are two different stages. There's eight different levels, if you want to call it. <clears throat> now, compared to Bob at Smash, I think it's going to be a lot harder because you don't have lights. Um, and even I'm not good at Bob at Smash. Jeez, you, get, you really got to let you really got to let me play it because 
if I'm going to be one of the first people that is visually impaired to beat it, then I'd say, then yeah, I'd say, yeah, I'd be great at beating Boppet Tetris if, I mean, it's like the Boppet Smash. You get a certain amount of points, you win. It doesn't require you to get a bunch of points. It depends on your skill level. Like, if you don't get a lot of bonus points or whatever, <clears throat> and uh, <clears throat> if you end up getting, then the lowest you can get is like maybe four or five hundred. And then that's the lowest. I don't even know if I could even make it past the first round. There's like, um, I don't know, ten different rounds. Like, I mean, there's, there's two different stages. I don't even know if I can make it past the, <clears throat> the first puzzle. Like, there are different puzzles in this Bob of Tetris that I could be getting, but I don't know. But <clears throat> I could also be getting the two other Bob and Micros, which are the Bob and Minion and the Bob and BB-8. So, boom. I might be getting the two... Bop and Micros that I've wanted throughout the, the two years that I've heard about them. <clears throat> but anyways, um, guys, um, I know I could be doing a TTS video or whatever. I know I said I could be doing a TTS video, Petrol Lover, but <clears throat> I've been busy these past few days, and I haven't had time to, I'm not going to say what I've been busy with, but I have been busy with stuff. I'm not telling you what, because it's personal, but I have been busy <clears throat> the past few days, so... For sure, if I get enough time tomorrow, I'm going to make it. Tomorrow's the 15th, so... Yeah. Not too long ago, two years ago, I done my first pop -it video. With the pop show and the pop it show, Carabiner. <clears throat> <clears throat> so, uh... <clears throat> If you know of anything you want me to do in a future um, in a future video, please let me know. Goodbye.